All right, so you're having a little problem with your earbuds or your earphones. They don't work either in one side or on both sides, but you don't know. Is the problem your device or is the problem your earbuds? Well, here's a little test and it involves using a potato. This one's kind of small, but it's good. A larger one will work just fine as well. A penny. We're running out of these in Canada, so we don't use them anymore. A galvanized nail. That's all you're going to need. So let's put it together. First thing you're going to do is you're going to take your penny or some piece of copper. That's sufficient as well. And you're going to jam it into the potato. Just like this. Right in. About two-thirds of the way in or whatever. Something that gets it right into the meat of the potato. And then you're going to take a galvanized nail like this one. And you're going to shove it right in, right beside the penny. Close, but not in contact with the penny. Okay. So there you go. Now, let me just put these... I'm going to put these uh, earphones onto the camera so you can hear exactly what I'm doing. Alright, so that took a little bit of work. So the earphones are on the camera microphones. So you're going to hear the left earbud and the right earbud making noise as I put the connector of the earbud in contact with the copper penny and the galvanized nail. Now listen carefully. That's one side. That should be the left side making noise. And this should be the right side making noise. If the left side and right side make noise, that means there is electrical continuity within the wires of your earbud that go from the connector all the way up to each earbud. All right, so this rules out an electrical problem within the earbud. If you're still having a problem with your audio and your earbuds, you might want to check out my other video titled Simple Fix for Earbuds Not Working. Just out of interest, I wanted to show you the output of this potato battery, as you want to call it. So uh, let's check first the voltage. We're set on DC volts. DC voltage is 0 0.9 volts. Now we're going to check for the current. We'll check that in milliamps. As this thing will have very little output. Under short circuit conditions, this thing puts out 0 0.4 milliamps. Very little current. Not enough to cause any damage whatsoever to earbuds. Thanks for watching, and please check out my other video. The link is below in the notes. Thanks.